please. The show starts in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to another Sea of Thieves live stream. How's everyone doing? I do not have my... You know what? I think I'm just going to leave my lights off tonight. They're kind of blind. They kind of blind me anyway sometimes. The lights that I actually have up here... Hey, look at Jazza coming through with a five-month membership. The Team Justice too. Hello, cuz. Love and miss you. Can't wait for the visit with the family. I will be up this summer. I will be up. Just give me some time. We're going to plan for it, and Brittany's going to take some vacation. I'm going to bring her and the kids up there so y'all can meet them, and uh, I will definitely be stopping by to see you. Um, you'll have to tell me where you live at, though. You'll have to, like, give me your address so I can GPS it and come right to your front door. Um, but I love and miss you, too, sweetheart. Thank you for your longtime love and support. I really appreciate that. Jessica Chalk's up in the house with that five-month membership. Lauren Rosker's up in the house. John Richards, some more members right there. Holly uh, Stefafini up in the house. Auto, that's me. What's up, man? I have not seen you for a while. Gotten trouble by other players yet or gotten your ship. To... Yeah, I mean, people don't... It's not really trolling. It's just part of the game. I mean, if, you've, if you're asking me if I've gotten shot by other people, yeah. Yeah, I got... I was playing on the... Jason Everett, like in the stream over on Facebook. Thank you, Jason. Appreciate you, brother. Steven Bear, as always, coming through with a gifted membership to team... I mean, a gifted membership... And Holly Stefafini got it. Jeffrey Gimbalos, thank you, man. I really appreciate you, dude. Thank you, Stephen. You're, he comes through every, literally every stream. Stephen is always dropping a gift of membership, man. I appreciate you, Stephen. Thank you, bro. Jeffrey Gamer up in the house. Sup, son? What is going on, Jeffrey? Guys and girls, if you are a member, drop those Jeffrey Gamer logos in the chat. And I will drop Jeffrey's command right there, as well as his channel, if my stream elements is even working. You know, I always make a notion. Um, yeah, it's working. I always make a notion before I go live. Every time I do it, I always go to my cloud bot. I turn it off and I turn it back on just to make sure it's going to work. Let me drop the Jeffrey Gamer logos. There it is right there. I finally put the commands in my stream deck, Jeffrey. Or, you know, some anyway. Like I put in, um, I put in the rules command, my Twitter command, Twitch, PC specs, uh, and I put this one in specifically because I get this a lot. Um, it's just exclamation point live, and uh, when you hit it, it pulls that up right there, because you know, you know, we get that. As content creators, we get that a lot. So I do have that one in. I got the rules in. Um, I need to actually have like the commands in where it shows all the commands. I need to put that one in, but. I've got, I've got um, six commands in so far. So, and then plus I've got my regular YouTube buttons that I drop uh, for other things. Also, guys, uh, before we get started, I always want to start the stream with a. Um, how do I say? This? I always want to start the stream with something to do about God. Okay, so everybody, uh, for those out there who have been watching my streams on biblical end time prophecy. And just talking about Jesus and bringing people to Christ. If you want your own Bible app for your phone, and this is the Bible app that CJ uses. It's called the Blue Letter Bible. And what's really cool about this Bible app is I'm feeling good, Jeffrey. I'm feeling I feel amazing today, dude. I went to dialysis this morning, man. I only got about probably two hours of sleep last night. <laughs> got up at 3.30, went to dialysis, come home, slept from about, I don't know, uh, one thirty till almost three, and uh, woke up. Uh, got motivated, and here I am, man. I feel good. Um, but for those who want your own Bible app, and this Blue Letter Bible app is really cool. And the coolest thing about it is you can translate your King James version to like New International Version, or New International Version to King James Version, or you can just do like I do and read New International Version. Now, New International Version, from what I've read so far, it's very accurate with the King James. And 
For those that don't know what the King James Version is, King James was the guy that took the Hebrew version of the Bible because as everybody knows the Bible was written in Hebrew back in the day, you know, in Jesus' day. It was all written in Hebrew, and it had to be translated for the modern-day people like us to understand. So that's who King James is. That's who he was. He took the Hebrew Bible, and he translated it over to King James English. And you can translate it from King James to the International Version to CSB to New King James to Old King James, and the Bible will actually read to you. I plug my Bible up into my phone. I mean, I'm sorry, into my uh, auxiliary cable, my truck on the way to Dallas in the morning, on the way home, and I list my Bible all the way there and back. Now, I've got the uh, link for Apple users here, and I've also got the link for Android users. So for people like Jeffrey who uses Android, bleh, <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. For people who use Android um, and Apple, there's the links. Get that Bible app, guys. It's really cool. And for those who don't want to take the time to read, it will read to you. And that's okay because the Bible says we're supposed to be fed the word. And someone reading to you is being fed the word. So just keep that in mind, guys. But I did want to start the stream with that. God bless you guys. I hope you enjoy the stream. We are going to try and got us some treasure. What is that? Oh, thanks, baby. Thanks. And I do have a, um, I am going to be going and playing golf tomorrow. I have a tea time for 8 o'clock in the morning. I did invite the wife to go, but she don't want to go with me, so. Hey, McLovin up in the house and Echo Heaven right there. What's up, Austin? I ain't seen you for a long time, dude. John McLovin, Jessica. Baby, I was just kidding with you. Um, Jeffrey up in the house. We got a lot of members. Gypsy, there you are, Gypsy. I was just thinking about you yesterday, man. Gypsy up in the house. Sorry, man, I didn't see you, bro. Got some members up in here. What's up, Austin? How you doing? What's up, son? All right, guys, so I'm pretty stoked about tonight's stream. I do have the fan on me because, like, it gets really hot in here when this PC's running, man. Like, and I'm back in a corner, so it gets pretty, pretty hot. And so we're going to go ahead, and I don't think I have anything in my inventory. Let's make sure of our ammo is reloaded. I think it is. All right, we're good to go. Let's go ahead and go to the quest table, and let's go and do one of these here. I think we're going to do the three treasure chests. Let's do that. And we're going to dive the location. All right. And the game. Yo, check this out, John, because I know that you know a lot about this game. Um, so I was playing this game yesterday, and it was glitching on me. And I'm going to tell you how it was glitching. Every time I would do a quest, it would show the quest laying on the table, and it would tell me to pick the quest up. And I would go to pick the quest up. When I would, it wouldn't be in my, you know, like my quest right here. It would just disappear. So I had to restart the game. So if anybody has that problem, just make sure you restart the game. Ooh, look at this. Now, we are going to do something spectacular um, with this particular um, stream. And for those who have not seen what happens when you dive to your location, it is pretty phenomenal, to say the least. Um, all right, let's get the uh, – we got to be in open seas. And this is it. For those who want to go to your location quick, this is the easiest way to do it, man. This is the easiest way to do it. All right, so here we go. And we do have some new stuff, guys. We got a new compass. Uh, we have a new lantern. We've got a new shovel. We've got a new scope. Um, we've got a new one of these right here. We've also got uh, some new instruments. See that, guys? Pretty cool, huh? We got a new cup. Don't want to drink too much because he'll get... Hey, what's up, Jason? How you doing, man? Good to see you, man. Jason Everett up in the house. Thank you for sharing the stream, Jason. I appreciate you, brother. We're live on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitch. Uh, tomorrow night, guys, we'll probably be going live on Facebook, YouTube, Twitch, and Twitter. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Y'all can't even hear the game. I didn't have the game volume on. What an idiot. I didn't have the game volume on. It's Butimus. And y'all can't even see the game either. Look at me. I'm such a noob. <laughs> I'm such a noob. Man, Jeffrey, how many times do we make that mistake, man? You should, Jeffrey. You should totally re-download this game. You should. I'm slipping, John. I'm slipping, man. <laughs> man, I... You know, you would think as many times as we do this stuff, we would never, ever forget to do things like that, but we do. We forget it. It's something every time. It's either we forget to do things like that, or right at the last minute, something always goes wrong. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, Jerry. It happens, man. It happens. 
and it makes you feel so like I don't know it just makes you feel dumb like it makes me feel stupid when I realize check out the shark over there guys look see even y'all did y'all see that he was in the distance this is like perfect music for the water epidemic sounds baby yeah noobish man I am. I am under the water, Jazz. Yes, I am. I figured this out the other day. Jason over on Facebook. Thank you, Jason. I appreciate you, brother. Yeah, we need you, Austin. Definitely. <laughs> He's under the sea. Did you like my title, Jeffrey? <laughs> oh man see and what's crazy about it is even when you're under the water you can't steer your boat I mean you can turn it but it's not gonna because it's on an automatic waypoint so you know you might as well just uh, I don't even know if you can jump off your boat but we're not gonna find out you can just sit down back here and just chill man and my guy's lips move when I talk. It's pretty cool. I'm gonna make him dance. <laughs> this game is so awesome. I love it. I'm so addicted to it. I got it when it first came out. All right, Jerry. I appreciate you, brother. You going live tonight on SLRP, guys? Make sure you go check out Jerry Gamer on SLRP tonight. He will be live at eight o'clock, right? Eastern Standard Time. Or no, that'll be central. No, you'll be live at seven your time, right? No, you'll be live at eight. Eight, eight o'clock. That's what I thought. Okay. So make sure you go check him out. We'll see you in a few minutes, brother. You know I'll be popping in, man. This music is cool, man. go guys up and up and the coolest thing about this take care brother I love you man I love you brother I will do Austin I will text you man I'm going tomorrow Austin I got a tea time for eight o'clock here we go guys thing up a little bit. Alrighty. Well, probably not quite that much. I think I slowed it down a little bit too much. There we go. So this is going to be our island. Um, Austin, have you ever played this game, man? See if these? Do you have it? Man. See, that would be cool if we get, like, me, Jeffrey, John, Austin, like, uh, Chris Roman, a bunch of us together because this game... The more people you have, the the more, the funner it is to play. Hey, check, the, John, are you still in here? I, I have not done the tall tales yet, uh, Gypsy. I have not, but I am very curious about it. And, you know, as to, like, you know, what they're all about. Are they cool? Have you done them? Ooh, that was close. Look how the boat slid down. Ooh, look how close we were to hitting, man. All right, I just want, I know there's probably no holes, but I want to double check just to make sure. It's just my, it's my OCD telling me to look. They're pretty fun. Some of them take a couple of hours. Oh, really? I'll have to do that on my own time and check them out and then do them live. Um, so check this out, John. I was playing on, um, higher seas yesterday not safer seas I'm on safer seas right now but I was playing on higher seas yesterday I think that's what it's called and um there was this I was out looking for treasure right I was doing like the you know the the gold treasure or whatever it is that I'm, that I'm doing now and these I, I was I was about I was getting back on my boat because I found some treasure and here comes this pirate ship and they've got a big their sail is like a is black and it's got a skull on it so immediately i'm thinking okay these guys are going to want to fight 
So I'm, get, I'm trying to get in my boat, I'm, and there's only one of me. There's like five of these guys, five or six of these guys. And I'm pushing my anchor as fast as I can to get it up. And the guy hops the boat. He says, yo, hold up, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. He's like, we got some treasure for you, man. Dude, these guys gave me like, a, like it was like, I don't know, thirty, forty thousand dollars $40,000 worth of treasure. Like, they just gave it to me. And I couldn't talk because I don't have my mic on in game. And I really wasn't sh I couldn't remember who they were. And I didn't know until I went back and looked. But I can go like this. And I could have said thanks you know what i mean but i didn't you know the only thing i was able to say was a hey. you know but i think he knew what i meant but anyway man it was really cool they gave me like two or three big treasure chests they gave me some skulls dude i don't know whether you guys found that stuff but they had a lot of cool stuff man it was a lot of cool stuff hello One sec, guys. One second, guys. Hang on. These guys are vicious. Sorry, guys, I had to be dad for a minute. <laughs> uh, getting kids to clean up their stuff is like trying to get a flea to understand uh, anything at all, to say the least. Oh, we're out of ammo, guys. We gotta go back and get ammo. And then we gotta find this treasure. Gotta find me treasure. I appreciate y'all tuning in, man. Let me get a reload on my ammo here because we gotta use like... There we go. It'd be cool if they had like an ammo pouch you could carry on you. Like a, a pouch for ammo, for extra ammo, and a pouch for extra stuff for your inventory. You know what I'm saying? Or like a backpack or something. What'd they carry back then for stuff like bat like what were they like satchels? It was like satchels on their side, right? They carried like satchels on their side. Alrighty, so let's take a look. Now the best way I've found to do this is to get to the highest point of the rock of the, of the mountain or the hill, whatever you're on the island, I mean. Get to the highest point and try to look from the highest point that you can. That's the best way to do it because then you can look down. And you can actually kind of see the shape of the island a little bit. Just like so. 
All right, so we got three places. Three X's marks the spots. Three X's marks the spot. There we go. So we're going to have one that's going to be on that little island right there. So that island, little island right there, we got one on the outer edge of it, right? And then we got another one that's going to be about probably 10 foot in front of that one. And then another one back over this way, which is going to be, if we're going from this way, we would go from this direction. There'd be one on that small island there. The other one's going to be up in here somewhere, but at the bottom. And the other one's going to be over in this direction. All right. So, but I found for me, for me personally, I don't know how it works for everybody else. But for me personally, that's the easiest way for me to find this treasure. And sometimes it still gets pretty tough to find it. You can't always find everything. Oh, we need to eat that. I need to get my health full. Alright, so... Alrighty, so I'm pretty sure this is going to be on the outer edge of the island. Should be like right in here. Oh, let's see. No, no, it's going to be on this part. This over here, over here. That's right, right? This is the one. There's no other islands. Yeah, so it's got to be... Maybe in here? It's over here somewhere. We're not far from it. It's got to be in here somewhere. right here we'll find it we will find it I'll dig around this whole island if I have to <laughs> I'm gonna eat these just because I want to puke my want my guy to puke wait what <laughs> I don't know why I think that's so funny. I know, guys. I'm weird. Go next to the ship map. Go next to the ship map. Open your open your quest when you can't see the ship map and your quest at the same time. What do you? I don't understand what you mean, John. What do you mean the ship map? I don't know what you're talking about. You mean like the the map inside on 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 the ship, like the map table. Whoa, I hear something. <laughs> right, I'm puking and fighting. These guys still tend to get you, man. Ah, I moved. Quick scope, baby. Ooh, ammo pouches? Gold? Ooh, gold. Oh my gosh, what in the world? Come on, reload that gun. Goodness. That was a lot of them to take out. All right, let's get back to this quest. Dude, that has got to be over here somewhere. Like, if you don't get it right on the mark, you will not find it. Oh, no kidding, Austin? What was wrong with your PC? Use your ship as a guide point. I mean, I kind of know what you're saying, but... You mean as a guide point? Oh, wait, I know what you're talking about. I think I know what you're saying. Alright, 
let's get this pulled up here. Hey, new follower over on Twitch. Um, who was that? Six? Is that how you say it? Thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. And we got the Mario Expert Man over on Twitch. Love that name, dude. Oh, he's raiding me. Thank you, man. I appreciate the raid, dude. Thank you, Mario. I appreciate Dude, I love your name, man. The Mario Expert Man. I love that name, dude. Thank you for the raid, brother. I appreciate that, man. Welcome to the, the, to the channel over here, man. I appreciate that. Thank you, man. <laughs> that, that, I love that name. That name is awesome. Okay, so, I think what John is talking about is, yeah, that's definitely the island right there. That's definitely it. And it looks like the mark is like, it's like right in here, right? It's like between the, yeah, it's like right on the edge of the, I see what you're saying now, John. Is that what you're talking about? Is that what you're talking about, John? This is the only island over here by us. So there's no other island around. I'm, I'm pretty sure. There's no other island. Is that a rowboat? Dude, it is. I love the rowboats, man. Those are cool, man. I mean, so if I'm not mistaken, it should be like right here. That's the only place where there's distance between the grass. Like where there's a gap, you know what I'm saying? And it should be like right on the edge. Huh. This is the island, right? This is the island I'm on. This is it. Sorry, guys. I was making sure my stream was still running. Um, let me eat some food real quick. I'm just going to eat that coconut shell and all. Whatever that is. Tomato. I guess it's a tomato. Bro, it's got to be right in here somewhere. It's got to be. It's got to be right in here, man. It's got to be. Where is this thing at? Yeah, it says, like, right on the edge of the island. Huh. That is mighty weird. I mean, I'm literally digging. Oh, my gosh, these guys, man. Man, those things are get annoying after a while, huh? Maybe it's over here? No? It's gotta be this spot right over here. We have dug everywhere almost. It says it's right on the edge of the island. I am baffled. I... This is, this is God, this is the island, right? This is the spot. Unless there's another, I mean, it's the only one separated from it. There's two other islands around the other side of this island. King Zach Gaming, what is up, man? Hey, thank you for the kind words, brother. I appreciate that, man. I appreciate you, man. I really appreciate. I know. I know Jeffrey does. Jeffrey was just in here earlier, actually, man. Dude, I love your name, Kings Out Gaming. That's a pretty cool name. That is a pretty cool name. I love unique names like that. 
Like Jeffrey Gamer, that's unique. Criminal Justice, that's unique. I mean, I don't like my own name. I, I, I mean, I don't hate it. Y'all yeah, know what I'm trying to say. I don't want to sound prideful. I don't like sound prideful. I don't, I'm not, like, I'm not prideful at all. I'm not prideful. I'm not an arrogant person. I'm not, you know, mean. I'm not hateful. I don't, you know, I, I try to show everybody love and compassion. Yeah, I don't know, John. What do you think, man? Yeah, you should, John. I would watch him, bro. I would definitely watch him. Um, what do you think, John? It's supposed to be right here on the edge, man. This is it right here. You know what's puzzling me, though? Here's the thing. It's not showing no rock on that island. And there's rock right here. I just wonder if there's another part of the island around the other side. Is that it right there? All right, we'll go look. We're going we're gonna to look. Because I don't, I don't know. I mean... That looks like the only one that it could be, unless there's another one that's separated here somewhere. Oh, dude, is that it right there? Is this it? Yo, I bet this is the one, guys. Hey, we got a snake right here. Time we got two of them. Get beneath me, Satan, in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Good night, Satan. Get out of here, devil. <laughs> I think this is it right here, John. Oh, yeah, what is this? Ooh. Is there anything to dig in there? Can we dig in that? No, barely. All right, so let's see. <laughs> Never wear. Uh, I don't now see this one. Now, this one don't have a trail. But this one is also not connected either. And this one's off by itself, so... This might be it, this might not. I mean, it's got quite a few palm trees. And they look like they're in the shape of what's on here. So let's try... Let's try over here. I don't know if that's... There it is! That was it, man, there it is. King Zack Gaming coming through with a $5 super chat. Thank you, King Zack. Appreciate you, brother. Why does my stream deck never want to work when I need it to? Never, 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 never. Give me one second, brother. Thank you for that, um... Thank you for that donation, man. I really appreciate that, dude. Thank you so much. Now I can hit the button for you. Thank you, King Zach. I appreciate you, man. Thank you for that dono, man. Thank you, thank you. I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, are we out of ammo? We got one bullet left. I better make it count. All right, let's get this and get back to the ship. We'll come back and get the other ones in a minute. Because I can't. I got to have ammo. We'll come back to it. I need to bring my boat around. Oh, look. Look at here. What is that? That's treasure, too. Oh, I don't have any ammo. I was going to... You know what? We'll do like this. Can we push this boat out? We're gonna do like this. Uh, where's the oars at? Let me have the oars. I need to turn this boat around. These rowboats are pretty awesome, and I love these things, and they're pretty quick, to be honest about it. Come on, get it going. Ah, uh, come on. Push that thing, man. There we go. All right, now let's grab... Oh, he's coming right at me, dude. Let me grab this. Yeah, that snake's coming right at me. I don't want to get too close because he'll spit on me. There's that. All right, now let's get this thing. Can we push it back out this way? Uh, nope, we cannot. We're just going to have to roll with it. Let's see.
There we go. All right, now we can go, baby. Now we can go. Yeah, I appreciate you, King Stack. Thank you, brother. That's awesome, man. It never, it never depends on the amount of it, man. That's never the case. It's just the fact. It's the thought that counts, brother. It is the thought that counts, man. I really appreciate you, dude. I appreciate whether I get a one dollar, a five dollar, a fifty dollar, a hundred dollar. I don't care. You know. And I'm gonna tell you, man. For those who give. God has a very special place prepared in heaven for those who give. And that's no lie, guys. I wouldn't lie to you about that. I'm telling you. God has a very special place prepared in heaven for those who give. That is one of the, that is one of the many keys to God's heart and the, to the kingdom of God is giving. All right, there's that one. Let's see if there's anything in the storage on this. Let's see. Oh, yeah, there's all kinds of stuff, bro. And we're going to spend more time doing that than we would actually. But we need to empty our inventory anyway. Let's go ahead and empty all this out. All right, we'll empty all that out. Let's go ahead and reload our guns. All right, now we got ammo. And we can hop back in. And let's take this back over to the yeah. island. Yeah, this robo man is pretty cool. Come on. Get it moving. Get it moving. Let's go. Yeah, if you hold your thumb, if you hold your triggers like that for a second and give it like a full row like that, it it gets like it gets the little thing moving pretty quick, I'm not gonna lie. And then you can turn it, of course. There's a gunpowder barrel right there. We're gonna park the boat right here. We're gonna bank it. That way we can use it again if we need it. Okay, now let's get that map pulled back up. And let's see where else we gotta go. Oh, we should have went over the other side of the island. Well, actually, I hear a snake. There he is right there. Did y'all hear that? He spit at the last minute. We can cook that snake meat. We can cook that. Yo, what up, silly face? How you doing, man? What's going on, brother? Good to see you, man. Um. Okay, so let me think about this for a minute. So we just got that one from... That was so weird. It was a, a separate island. Like, I don't know. All right, so that's that one. So if that's the case, then going from this side, where do we dig that up from? It was, it was right here, right? It was right in here. This is where we dug it up from. Hey, there's some bananas right there. And we'll grab that wood plank. All right, so if we walk from this way, the other one should be over here. Let's see. I'm not gonna lie, sometimes getting, you know, find these chests can be pretty tough. It can be pretty tough. But we're looking for the one at the very corner of the island. Not the one up that way, but the one at the corner of the island. Which should be like pretty much directly across from it almost. Maybe like right in here? There it is. I swear that was just a wild guess, guys, I promise. <laughs> that was a wild guess. And that's that's what's that's the deal with this game is find these treasure chests. You've got your map to help you, but pretty much you're just it's a wild guess, you, you know. And if you don't hit it right on the mark, like what the map says, if you don't hit it right on that mark where X marks the spot, you will you can go right beside it, you will not find it. You've got to hit it right on the mark, man. And I think that's a really oh man, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. We gotta go. Come on. about oh they threw that gun bar that gunpowder barrel at me well we won't lose our treasure because we offered ourselves the ferryman so hopefully I didn't lose that one either because that's two good treasure ships we got one more to find let's go up here and talk to the Sup, son? all right 
So anytime you die on the game, always immediately offer your soul to the ferryman. That way you don't lose your treasure. See, we didn't lose our treasure. So where's the... So the rowboat should be back over there. And our treasure... Uh, I hope our treasure box is still in there. I hope we didn't lose it. Where's our rowboat? Man, I could have got my ship a lot closer than what I did, man. Way closer, dude. But the thing is, you never know how shallow these waters are, and you don't want to, you know, rub the bottom of your ship. Because once you start messing your ship up and you destroy it, like, it gets destroyed so much, it'll just start tearing up on you all the time. And... Yo, where's the... Oh, there's my treasure chest right there. All right, awesome. I don't know where the rowboat is, but at least we found the treasure chest. Anything weird in these waters? Shark or anything like that? You know, the one thing I've not seen in here yet is a Kraken. Is there Kraken? Does anybody know for that plays these games? Is there actually Krakens in the game? Are they actually like a part of the game? That'd be cool if they had Krakens in the game. I mean, I've, I've, I've seen places like Krakens fall and stuff like that, but I've not actually seen Kraken. Is there, John? Have you seen one? I would love to find one, dude. Where would I find one at? Alright. Well, I wish that robot was still out here. That thing is super useful, man. It's super useful. Alright, so here's where we found this treasure chest, which was right here. So let's get the map pulled up real quick and see something. The other one, the other one should be, this is going to be hard to find, I think. Pretty sure this is going to be tough to find. If I'm not mistaken, it should be right up in that area, right up in there somewhere. Maybe. We'll see. Let me, uh, Lord have mercy. Oh, I did not see him. Reload, reload, reload. Come on. I missed him. Got him that time. I love them quick scope shots. You just pull your scope up and pull the trigger. I love it. All right, so we're going to leave that treasure chest sitting right there. And we're going to walk up this way. Give me that. Cook some bacon. Well, I don't have any room. I'll have to eat a coconut so I can have some room. There we go. We'll go back and cook us some bacon. <laughs> there it is, baby. There it is. It is there. Oh, man. Oh, are we out of ammo, dude? Nice to get two birds and one stone. We are out of ammo. We are out of ammo. Yep, we are completely out of ammo. All right. Nope, closer, closer. There's a certain distance. I mean, if you stand. It'll, um, you can dig it up a little quicker. There, there goes that snake right there. There he is right there. Look at him. King Cobra. Ain't no scare me, boy. Sang! We're not supposed to be scared of evil. We're supposed to only fear God. God says, fear me only. If you think about it, why would we fear the devil? You know what I mean? Why would we fear evil? Because evil can't, evil can mess with us here. But they can't enter here. God, the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit dwells in your heart. That's where they dwell. The devil can mess with you up here, but he can't mess with you here. Right? But the thing about God, the reason we fear him is because he created us. He can destroy us. It's like the old saying your mom used to say to you, right? Or your dad, boy, I created you. I, I brought you in this world. I can take you out. That's how it is with God. He brought us in this world. He can take us out. Let me refill my ammo real quick just in case we were running some trouble on the way back. That's 
grab us another treasure chest and we'll be on our way. Hey, yo, Newman, what is up? Dude, I haven't seen you for a long time in here, brother. Newman is up in the house. Newman Gaming. What's up, son? What's up, Newman? How you doing, man? Good to see you, dude. Good to see you, man. How you been, bro? I haven't seen you in here for a long time, man. You been, you still, um... You still doing your RP, man? Good to see you, Newman. I haven't seen you for a long time, brother. It is really good to see you. It's good to see you too, man. Legendary Newman Gaming up in the house, ladies and gentlemen. You ladies and gentlemen are awesome. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Something like that, right? Was that close? <laughs> I don't know if I got the accent as deep as you do, bro. You got that southern draw. Pretty good, man. You got it pretty good. You ladies and gentlemen are awesome. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. That's but my voice needs to be deeper, right? It needs to be because you got a deep voice. You ladies and gentlemen are awesome. You ladies and gentlemen are awesome. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Something like that. <laughs> Something's glimmering over there. What is that? What's glimmering over? Something's glimmering over here, man. Oh. You know what that is, guys? Those are skulls. And they are worth a lot of money when you take them to the Order of Souls. These will go to the Gold Hoarder. Which is kind of a ripoff because they don't really give you much for it. But So here's what we're going to do. I am going to leave the cell where it is. And we are going to make a sharp turn. We're going to turn this butt baby around. And we're going to go grab these skulls. Deeper. You ladies and gentlemen. You ladies and gentlemen are awesome. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. <laughs> man, that's close, man. That's close. <laughs> I can't do it just like you, man. Hey, appreciate you hyping it up, Newman. It's good to see you in here, man. <laughs> yeah, Newman's got like a real deep, like... Newman's got like, his voice is so Southern, right? He's got like that Southern Kentucky Fried Chicken, uh, you know, down South voice, man. That's what I love about Newman is like your voice, bro. You've got a voice for YouTube, man. No doubt about it. You've definitely got a voice for YouTube, man, for sure. All right, that's down. Make sure we didn't hit. We're good. Still my ammo. Man, these guys. Oh, there's a lot of these here. Probably, probably just been better. To, oh, man. Probably just been better to get him from the ship. I'm going to just go back on the ship. And we're going to go up there. I had a feeling somebody would be guarding him. I had a feeling they would. Go, go, go. Get up that ladder. Go. So we're going to stand up here. We're going to get up here. That's how we're going to do it. Let's reload. Where are they at? Done. Oh, how did I not get him? Can we shoot him with a cannon? Oh, did I not load my cannons? What is wrong with me? Yeah, it's gonna go over him anyway. Gold pouch and an ammo pouch. So two gold pouches and an ammo pouch. Nice. Ooh, more gold pouches. I'll take those any day. That's money. Oh, yeah. Look at that, baby. Hi, babe. All right, so now where's these skulls at? Reload. This is the first island. Oh, it's another quest. Message in a bottle I think this is one of those quests where we have to go take out one of the wanted guys, like the wanted ghost. We have to take them out. Is there anything over here uh, in these barrels at all? Yeah, we got a plank and a banana. That'll work. We could use that banana. We'll eat a couple of those so we can heal up real quick. All right. Okay, guys, I think we're done here. I think, But I thought I seen two things glimmering over here. There is. 
There was. Two quests. All right. So, hey, baby. Hey, Brittany. Did you get me some... You got me some drinks, right? Can you bring me one, please? Thank you. My wife is the best, but she don't know it. My wife don't give herself near enough credit for how amazing she really is. And we also got a new drum too, guys. Check this out. Watch this. Alright, let's make sure we're playing this. and key with it. Isn't that cool? It's a key with it. Pretty awesome, right? It's it's right in key with it, man. It's right in key with it. Welcome back, Jessica. Good to have you back. It's right in key with it, man. I think it's so cool. You just gotta time you gotta time it just right. So when the music starts and then you let it go. Do it again. All right, let's ring that bell, baby. We gotta load this. Uh, we gotta load those, man. We already got one of those. Let's see, what is this? All right, let's fire it off. Look at that, guys. Pretty cool, right? The flares. And there's spots. If you get the right spots, you can find actual fireworks. I wish I could find the uh, Kraken firework, you guys. That firework is... It is awesome, and I love it. Look at this guy. Ooh, how did I not hit the barrel? I hit the barrel. Man, you ain't no good bro. You ain't no good at shooting. You got him. Let me see if we can't hit that barrel. If you hit it, it'll blow up. There we go. Ooh, that moved the boat. Yeah, I can see one of them things. Those things are powerful, man. No wonder they hurt me when I'm still like five to six foot behind, like, away from them. And I shoot it, it, like it hurts me sometimes. That's wild. Okay. So, let's refill our ammo. And we'll be good to go on that. And I think we're good to go. We just got to find an outpost to go to now. Okay. Let's check the map. Let's see right here. Dagger Tooth Outpost. This is the one we're going to. Let's remove all our markers. So we got to go. Um, we got to make a U-turn and we got to go west. Got to make a U-turn. We got to go west. We need to make sure these are loaded up. Let me fix this one. At least got to have something in it. So we got a cannonball on that one, and we got a cannonball. We did not, thought I loaded this. There we go. Maybe I unloaded, I don't know. All right, let's take all of our inventory down here and stock it. Yeah, so you can like take this snake meat right here and you can cook it. It's really cool, man, how you can do all that. It's pretty good. All right, guys, so we gotta turn, make a U-turn and go west. Let's do it. Are you tired more now, Jessica? Are you? Been at work today? Yeah. Oh, we didn't hit, did we? How close are we to the um, shoreline right there? Okay. I guess we weren't close enough to hit. All right, let's grab the wheel. Man, guys, y'all just don't understand how much I love playing this game. It's so much fun. No, where's the other one? How's the music in my voice, guys? Is the music okay? It's not too loud or anything like that?
Sounds good. All right. As long as you guys can still hear me up with music, that's what all that matters. I just don't want to like, I don't want to drown the music out and I want the music to drown me out. And while we're traveling here, I'm going to uh, have a seat. I'm going to give me a drink of this. I don't know what it's oh my gosh, I'm going north like an idiot. I meant to go west, but I was going west. I went north. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. This is probably our um Whoa, don't hit that. Yo guys, look we're just barely missing this. Look. This is probably our outpost right here. Uh, I don't think I want to go over there. <laughs> that doesn't look too promising. I think we're going to go to the next one, guys. Yeah. That's the one I tried to go to before, and it didn't have nothing there. So we're going to go to the next one. Let me see where the next closest outpost is. Um, right here. Let's remove that one. Let's go to Ga uh, Galleon's Grave Outpost. So we need to turn. And we need to go pretty much like southeast. Yeah, we need to go southeast. So let's make a turn. Taco Bell sound? That one? <laughs> Could be any of those. <laughs> oh, there we go, Southeast, Southeast. Yeah, that's where we want to go. What is this coming up? Oh, okay, never mind. That was a ship. That was a shipwreck. If you, if you find, you can find shipwrecks out here, and if you find them, you can drop your anchor. Yeah, that's our outpost up there. This is the definite outpost up here. Right there, that's an outpost. Man, that would really be bad if I pulled my boat. Matthew Coleman coming through Flex that 29 month membership, the Team Justice won. CJ, my brother, keep the work. Good, uh, good work. Love you, brother. Love you too, Matty. Thank you for your long time. Love and support, Matthew, coming up in the house. Thank you, man. Appreciate you, brother. I was wondering where he was, man. I was like, where's Matthew? He's always up in here. I was like, where's my boy at? Sam? Good to see you, Matthew. Thank you for your support, brother. I appreciate you, man. Ooh, sorry, guys. Was that the one, Jessica, you were looking for? <laughs> Oh, man.
All right, guys, just make sure that I can hear my music. All right, we gotta, we gotta start slowing the boat up. Oh, man, no, 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 we're gonna hit, we're gonna hit. Turn. Sell this treasure, man. Let's go sell this treasure. So the treasure chest normally goes to the gold hoarder. Um, and we gotta find the quickest way to get to him here. I'll find it once I get up here and know where he's at. So let's see. Okay, we're at the dock. He's probably. All right. Let's see. He's usually like in a tent by himself. This is him right here. He's always got the key on the side of his, uh... You can sell that to him just like that right there. Let's go back and get our other ones. So we're making quite a bit of money. I have an alternate account too for, um... For CSPs, I have a second account. Um... And if you're still in here, John, I'll give you that, uh... John, you have to send me another invite to that that thing that you created um, because it's just a habit. And before I before I knew you sent me a notification, um, I deleted I re, I deleted all my um, I marked all my notifications as red. And when I seen that, when I deleted and thing on the bound, and then when you said, "Hey, I sent you an invite over text," which I seen, but I didn't see your invite until I already deleted it. So. If you can see me another one, John, that'd be great, and then I'll join it, man. <coughs> so yeah, the gold hoarder's always got the key on the side of his um his tent here. So how much did he give me? Say he's a ripoff. You can see why they call him a hoarder. He wants to take all your good Oh dude, is that a shark? It is. All right, one more shot should get him. And like anything else, you can pick up the shark meat. You can cook it. Why is it? You get sick of shark meat wrong? Probably. That's probably definitely going to make him sick. Raw seafood like that? Ugh, straight up out of a shark. Ooh, raw. He's definitely gonna puke. I'd be surprised if he don't. I'd be greatly surprised if he doesn't puke. Is he really not gonna puke over raw shark meat? Like usually when he eats something wrong, he pukes. Something's chasing me. Here you go, buddy. So you get 456 per treasure chest. But if the thing is. If you're on higher seas and not on safer seas, you get more money. It's like $1,000 per treasure chest, I think. When you're on um, higher seas, you're... Uh, Lisa Tate following over on Twitch. Hammer over on uh, over on Twitch. I don't know how long you've been over there, brother. I'm sorry, man. I just seen you. Thank you, Hammer. Appreciate you showing your love over there, brother. You just now show up, man. Thank you, Lisa. I appreciate you following over on Twitch. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. What's up, Hammer? How you doing, brother? Stop! Hammer time! I need that sound in my stream deck just for Hammer, so when he comes in, I can hit it. He'll be like, stop! Hammer time! Or the sound of a jackhammer is... I'll find something for you, man. 
I need to get some sounds for y'all on my stream deck again. You know, I I I got rid of all my original sounds for that I have for everybody. Oh, you still at him too? How much is that? Man, you better start giving me some money, man, for the stuff I bring you, bro. I'm tired of you, bro. You understand me? I'm tired of you. Yeah, wave your hand at me because you know I can't shoot you. You look like it. What's up with that nose, man? What's up with that beak? Look at you. You got a fake eye. And I don't. How about that? Both of my eyes are real. You're blind in one eye and I'm not. Ha ha. <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. But yeah, if you're on higher seas, which I probably should be on, um, it'd probably be a lot more fun that way. And you earn more money and rewards that way, too, if you're on higher seas. We might switch over to higher seas. Um, I think that was it, right? Is that the treasure chest and the treasure chest? Is that it? Yeah. Okay, so this time, what we're going to do... Let's reload our ammo. I want to get new... Um, it's so hard to earn money, man. It's just really... I wish they had Wii Mod for Sea of Thieves, but they probably never will because it's an online game, so... You know... But here's what we're going to do. Let me switch over. And we're going to go to higher seas. And I'm, I'm, I pray that I can switch back over. So what I was saying, uh, or I pray that I remember to switch my scenes back over. What I was saying a while ago, guys, is that... Um, you know, all the old sounds I had for everybody... Um, some of them were, you know, pretty bad. Some of them, were, and they were bad in my opinion. They had bad words and stuff. And I'm just not gonna, I don't live like that anymore. You know, when you give your, when you give your heart to Christ, like I told you guys in the last stream where we talked about scripture. So I'm gonna go ahead and switch the scenes over so I don't, so I don't forget. When, when you, when any, when, who, no matter who you are, when you give your heart to Christ, high seas, what's it called, guys? Not higher seas, high seas. And we're gonna, we're still gonna get the small ship. Um, close crew. All right. But when you give your heart to Christ, there has to be a transformation. So there has to be a change in who you are. So you put off the old, basically, and you put on the new. It's like baptism. When you go under the water, you kill off the old person, you bring up the new person. Now, baptism don't save you, right? Baptism is just a representation of the death of Christ going down and then the resurrection of Christ as you come up. That's all that means. But God tells us to be baptized. However, baptism doesn't save you. But what does save you is repenting and asking Christ to come into your heart. But what I was saying is when you, when you give your heart to Christ, there's a transformation that has to take place. You can't just, I mean, if we, if we gave our heart to Christ and then still went out and did the same old sinful things with the same old sinful life and wasn't at least trying, then, you know, we're doing it in vain, right? It'd be doing it done in vain. So, Rondo, what is going on? You are new. Welcome to the live stream. I'm going to be fair. This doesn't seem right. What's so unholy about it? What do you mean? Like, what's, what's unholy about it? I, I'll tell you like this, Rondo. I get what you're saying. I completely get what you're saying. I would rather play this. I feel more comfortable playing this than I do like GTA V. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That is very true. That is very true. You make a good point, Ron. That's a good point. But I feel more comfortable. I don't have many games I can play, but I would rather play this rather than playing something like GT5, LSPDFR. You know what I'm saying? Oh, dude. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. But there has to be, what I'm saying is there has, but I get what you're saying, Rondo. Absolutely. I agree with you. There's a transformation that has to take place. So if you, if you give your heart to Christ and then you turn right around and you're not at least trying to be sin free, or trying to get away from the old life that you once lived, then you're doing it in vain, right? My point to it all is the old buttons I had in my stream deck that had a lot of bad words and stuff in it that wasn't very nice. You know, like John's button, it was pretty bad. <laughs> Y'all remember what John's button was, right? It was Afro Man. So that's why I'm redoing my stream deck buttons, but I'm going to start getting sounds for every single person. And I do mean literally every person that comes to the stream. You will have a very unique sound. So when you come in, I can hit your button. You will know exactly who you are as soon as I hit that button. So, for example, if I made this button for Rondo, right? And, of course, my stream deck is not working again. I don't know why my stream deck freezes up during stream, but it does. And the only way I can get it to unfreeze is like this. 
and now it's unfroze. That's weird. So if I got this button for Rondo right here, if I did this one, don't think this is weird, man. So if I did that button for Rondo, that'd be his button every time he'd come in, or this one, right? Um, anybody who has a unique button, I will have one for you. And if you cut on my shoes on a regular basis, I will give you a button. I will give you a sound. If you want a specific sound, as long as it's clean, as long as it's like not ungodly or anything like that, I will get it for you. If you want a specific sound, tell me. And if it fits the standards of, of godliness, then I will put it in the stream deck. You didn't hear the button? Oh, because I don't have my game audio on Sora. Sorry, here it is. So if I did this one for Rondo. Like I said, don't think that's weird, man. <laughs> Just an example. Or this one. Now see, this button right here I specifically have for Benzo when he comes to my chat because it's his tune. So that's Benzo's button, right? When he comes to the chat. But I do have this one. <laughs> Alright guys, so keep in mind that we are now on high seas, which means we are in we're in a private session, but we're still in a session with other players who can uh, take our boat, steal our treasure, you know, that sort of thing. So where's the other ladder at right here? I don't really care too much for this specific island right here. I don't know why, but I just don't. Even though it's a lot easier to find things around this part of the island, I don't know. Maybe it's just that right there. I don't care too much. Well, I don't know. Let's uh, let's try to get some supplies real quick. Oh, we found fireworks. Yo, nice. Yes, man. Fireworks, dude. What kind of fireworks are they? What are they? The Reaper's Blade Firework. Yes, man. Let's set these off. These are awesome, dude. These are awesome. All right. Let's, uh... All right. All right. Let's go down here. I want to set them off while they're dark, so let's put that in there. And then we'll grab we'll grab this. We're gonna load it in. Oh, look at that, man! That's dope, man. I haven't seen that one before. Yo, that is pretty cool, man. I wish I had more fireworks, though. I would love to have more fireworks. That would be awesome if we had more fireworks. So we're going to have to be on our P's and Q's, guys. Like I said, when I was playing yesterday, um, there was some guys. There was these one guys, man, that, um, that were I thought what I thought were chasing me down because I was on this island getting treasure. And... I thought they were chasing me down, but come to find out, they jumped on my ship and just wanted to give me some treasure. That's all they did. Hey, man, he's like, hey, man, take all this treasure and make sure you take it fast because we just stole it from the guy down here. So I was like, you know, I couldn't talk to them a mic on uh, to talk, but I was thinking, all right, cool, man. It was really nice of them to do that. It was like four or five pirates on one boat, and they jumped on mine, and here I am. I'm trying to get my anchor up as fast as I can to get away from them. And they're like all piling on my boat. I'm thinking, oh my gosh, they're going to take me out and kill me, man, and take all my stuff. Because I had a, I already had a couple treasure chests on the boat. But, man, they gave me like, I don't know, um, how much I say it was earlier, guys? Like, um, man, it was a lot of treasure. I can't remember how much it was worth. I can't remember what I said earlier now. I don't want to contradict myself. It was, it was a lot. It was, it was treasure that was worth a lot. I'll tell you that. It was worth a lot. All right, guys, so... Let's uh, let's get a quest going. Yeah, I'm gonna check those tall tails out, man. I definitely gotta check them out. I want a pet. I want a pet so bad. How much are the pets, and where do you get them at? Hey, John, welcome back. Hey, John, do you know where to get the pets from, dude? I've heard about that, Rondo. I've had people tell me about the sword diving where you can lash like. 
you can lash. Is that what you mean? Like when with the sword, you can like kind of lash, lash, or or sprint with it. You can jump with it or whatever. Pirate Emporium. Is it on the island? Yeah, I'll switch that one out. How do you do it? You just, you hold it? Oh, there it is. Like that. Is that what you're talking about? You can jump if you time it right? All right. Oh. It wears him out, sounds like. Oh, I see. Okay. All right, I see. Yeah, I normally use the guns. Um, that's normally what I use. Let me get my sniper back. Or whatever that gun is. Yeah. So we'll trade that back out. Yeah, I normally use the guns, but I've used the sword before. It's actually pretty cool. It's not too bad. I did not know you could do that, though. I wasn't aware of that. Um, so... Wait a minute. What did I ask you, John? What did I say? Oh, the, the, the animals. At the outpost. Pirate Emporium. Okay, I'm going to go check it out. I don't know if I'm going to have to buy a, a pet, but we'll find out. Pirate Emporium. Let me go for this the sign. Where's the signs at? They should tell me where everything is. Right here. Um, Pirate Emporium? Yeah, I just need an invite. I, I what I was telling you earlier is that um Oh, with a sword and sniper's what you run. Yeah, I dig the sniper, Rondo. I really like it, man. I really like this the the um the sniper I, because the cool thing about it is you know if you're on your vessel and you see skeletons by the water by the island you can stand on your boat and shoot them you know with like that I, I I dig that sniper man it's great for shooting those and especially like snakes I use them a lot for snakes and I use the other gun for snakes as well whatever the other one's called the blunder whatever the blunder uh, I can't remember what it's called. There's a hidden room on the in the one of the outposts, really, like, or in each one of them. Oh, wait a minute! Is this the armory? Any questions wait, about guns? Wait, what? What does she have as far as? Oh, dude, I have the money to get a livery for my gun. Oh, dude, that livery is cool right there. That blue one, man. Yeah, the liveries, this is where it starts getting expensive. I really want that livery right there. That one looks cool. I have enough to get that one, really. I have enough to get the... But I want to make sure I have enough to get my sniper as well. You know what I mean? So, I think I have enough. No, I'd have to have 150 to get them both. Hey, that purple's pretty dope, I'm not going to lie. Oh, that one's cool. Some of them get pretty pricey, huh, guys? Look at that, 27000 Look at that. You guys know if there's a way you can purchase money on here, like through some kind of, uh, like, through Steam? That one right there is pretty dope. I'm not going to lie. I really like that one. Oh, that one's cool, man. The Ballista Eye of Reach. That one's really cool. I like that one. Stay sharp. Oh, you can't buy gold. You can't have to grind. Ah, all right. But you could. But you can purchase. Can I help But what you can compass? purchase is what the. What are the blue things? So you got your skull. Your skull there. So you got your skull up here. You got your little blue tab, and then you got your gold, right? So what are these two right here? Do you guys know? Really? You guys earn 200k a night? 
Do you guys play all the time, John? You and the wife? See, I wish my wife had time to play games with me, but she can't, man. See, that's the thing is we have a schedule. So when I come home from dialysis, um, I'm usually here by myself until about, you know, 1.30. And I have to go pick up my little one from preschool at 1.30. I get her. The other two girls get home around 3.30. And then I'm a full-time dad. The, the mom... My, my, my wife usually gets off work around 3.30 or 4, but lately she's been, today she worked over and had to work late. So, but from the time that she gets home, I have to go live and she's taking over being the parent, you know what I mean? So, we just kind of got to split it up. But if she had time, man, we would definitely do it for sure. The bell sound for Taco Bell? I don't think I have that, Jessica. I don't know if I have that. Um, I don't think I have that one. Um, yeah, I don't. Oh, that sounded chunky. <laughs> Give it your best shot. I wish you playing right now, John. Okay, so what did you say, John? The Pirate Emporium is that what you said for animals? But it doesn't. It doesn't show me where it is on here. What is this? This is clothing. I know this is clothing. Who are you exactly? Hey man, my, bro, don't be don't be so ugly. Oh, dude, I didn't know you could buy different types of makeup. Okay. Oh, there's the dangle chops right there, John. Look, <laughs> there's the dangle chops, man. Oh, dude, that's slick right there. Without the jacket, though, it would look good. I just wish they looked as clean on your body as they do, uh, you know, in the preview. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Once you put them on your body, they don't look clean no more. Oh, dude, you can get a hook hand. That's awesome. This game is so cool, man. And you can get a peg leg. I don't know if I want a peg leg. Do you walk differently? Does it slow down your walk if you get one? You can get a peg leg. You can get a patch on your eye. Oh, that's dope. What about different hats? Okay, here we go, man. Yeah, some hats, dude. Uh, what is? What about this one? Uh, that see, that looks like a Captain Jack Sparrow hat right there. What is that? Ooh, that's actually a good-looking pirate hat right there. I like that one. I guess they got hats for the ladies as well, too, huh? They got all kinds of pirate hats, man. They got, like, a lot of different ones. Oh, is that a bandana? Oh, it is. Yo, that's a bandana, man. That is awesome, because I love wearing bandanas. I wear them all the time. Yo, here we go. That 